everyone, it's uh, Chris, and I am now an independent Sensi consultant. I just started out, so I'm going to show you real quick. Sniffer testers <laughs> uh, came in, and uh, as did my kit, uh, it contained a full size warmer, a mini warmer. Uh, three bars, uh, those testers, um, you know, catalogs and uh, flyers, that type of thing. So lots of information there for me. And boy, am I getting, getting the emails with, uh, you know, training info on it. So I do want to look at those. But I did join because um, if you can see in front of me here, I'm a sensi addict, <laughs> um, but I wanted to show you how I'm storing things right now. I have pictures on my Instagram of how I used to store them in the wire baskets, and I was going to order another one of those because those fit over in this corner uh, very nicely, but I decided to try this system out. These drawers were on sale at Target a month or so ago uh, for $17, something like that. Um, and, uh, they're the wide drawers. I think you can see that from here. And they seem to really work, uh, well. I think you can, I think you can stack like six or seven, uh, so they stay. And you can see in that second drawer there, there's, there's some problems. Um, but my top two drawers here are going to be my fall scents and we're going to take a look at those and I can kind of give you an idea of how I'm storing. Up here I have this basket that I really love. Um, it's decoration right now. There's nothing in it. I think it would be great for my uh, warming basket and in fact I bought these baskets at Target originally um, to and that's how they were originally stored in I think I had like five or six of these. Um, and they did, they did store nicely. Um, if they leaked, oh, there's one, uh, they did leak through. So that's why I kind of stopped that. And currently my melting basket is, um, virtual, <laughs> uh, meaning I have a list. So let's see here. So, ba um, fall, there are some bakery fall in here, I guess. Um, and they're pretty much in order. They do slip and slide a little bit, um, but we're working as best as we can. Right over here is, uh, Autumn Croissant. Yep. Autumn Croissant. Uh, there's like, I believe two, I think, I think I'm missing some. Oh, there we go. We have a Disney Haunted Mansion, uh, just a couple bars and then a full bar. Wish I would have brought this back this year. I had it in my club, obviously, uh, just to get, well, not obviously, but just to get an extra bar. And um, I like it, but I, I used it in this office, which is the office. And um, so I work from here a couple days a week. And I have two, this one's almost always on. It's just not right now. Uh, so I have four warmers, so I use an entire bar over here, um, but I could barely smell that, um, uh, and I think, well, I don't know, I obviously didn't have an entire bar here, <laughs> so I'm not sure, um, how I did that, but I, I couldn't really smell it, um, so that's where we are there. Um, so here's the autumn croissants. There are two partial bars for some reason and a full bar there. That is in my car, uh, in my club and is staying there. I have an, a couple cubes left of oats and honey. Um, also butter pecan. I have a couple bars of, I think, oh, this one is like two and a partial bar. And uh, love those, though. Really do love those. Um, a little bit of oats and honey left. 
I liked it, but I really couldn't smell that either. Um, lots of banana nut bread here. Let's see. Some of these may be shifted. Yep. Um, a lot and of <laughs> toffee butter crunch because it is in my club and I'm getting a couple every other month. Um, so like 12 a year, but I bought, I stocked up and got, um, whatever I got originally plus six more in a, a sale. So I have a lot, but that's going to be used like crazy soon. Um, salted caramel cupcake. I have three in my club right now. Could I take it down, um, in the bi-monthly? Could I take that down to two? I could. Do I want to? Probably not. <laughs> um, let's see what we got here. This stack here, I believe is five of blackberry marmalade, blackberry orange marmalade. Love that scent. I did not get a chance in Bring Back My Bar. It is a Bring Back My Bar. Uh, to actually melt it. But I did like it. And I didn't put it in my club. Same with Buckleberry. So I have five of those as well. Um, in older Bring Back My Bear Bar. I have three. Sweet Plum Pastry. That's in my uh, bi-monthly club. And these do get kind of messy. You can see my hands uh, glistening from that. Um, but it's a great scent and I, I really love to use it. So I did use them all up and kind of restocking now. Um, and you know, that's that. Hufflepuff, love this. It is coming back uh, September 1st, I believe, in that Harvest Collection. Um, this was an amazing scent. Oops. I have a full bar and then six cubes. Um, I didn't keep it in my club. I will probably buy a couple more, but honestly, in this room, which is probably like 12 by 15, something like that, this office, two cubes, black two cubes, excuse me, lasted several days. And the smell lingered for days after I took it out. So not one I need in a club, but I probably will get a few more. Um, next to that, I have a partial bar of Mocha Doodle. Another one's coming uh, to me. It's in my club now. I don't know if I'll keep it in there. Um, I want to see how it smells. Oh, this had something else on it. I don't think this was it getting messy, but coffee tree, one bar of that. And I think I have a couple hugging a mug, a couple full bars of hugging a mug. Love that scent also. It's kind of one of those that is, again, out to, um, <laughs> out to see how it does because I didn't feel like it did very well, but it was an amazing scent. So we'll see. Um, lots of apple cherry uh, strudel because I was afraid that wouldn't come back. And thankfully it did. Um, I think I have five bars of that. One, two, three, four, five. Yep. And I think I recently used it. Love that one though. And then next to it is a bar that's in my monthly club. Red, white, and berry pie. Love that. I have a pretty large stash of Bath and Body Works sweet, pear, sweet cherry pie uh, candles. And oh my gosh, it's an amazing, it's amazing. One I wasn't sure of, uh, but I kept in my club for uh, two, uh, two bi-monthly caramel pear crisp. I used, I believe, a whole bar in here. Um, a few weeks ago, and it was amazing. It was strong. It was long-lasting. It was amazing. I had one of these um, that I got when I first got into Scentsy. So I saw on, um, I was searching <laughs> on like Facebook Marketplace, and I was able to get one of these, and I couldn't smell it, um, but it was amazing. So these, you know, were curing. I think I currently have five bars of that, but the two bars are going to stay in my club. That was a great scent. 
Graham Cracker Crunch was also in my club. Um, not anymore because it is available. That one's good. Again, um, for me, I want to try some of these mixes that people have been recommending. And I want to see if it is strong enough this year. Um, especially since they've been able to cure. So that's drawer number one. And this is just a mini fridge, guys. Um, it really doesn't have anything too exciting in it. Um, oh, yes, my favorite lint candies. Love the white. Oh, I'm a candy holic. All right. So little um, facial tools and these little ice packs here are actually for like a cooling fan that almost looks like a water bottle. All right. And thankfully, I put breakfast in bed in my club and I have a stash and I'm so happy because that's really, really one of my favorites and uh, I, I can't have too many of those. So, Bright Sutter Life. Okay, we'll start up here. Love you very much, Bright Sutter Life. Fell in love with that at the end of last year. Didn't put it in my club, I don't think, but stocked up on a few and I'm so glad it's back. In my club will always be in my club. Caramel Apple Craze, those are coming out in pods. I should have those in a couple days. Um, Disney Villains, I haven't heard that's coming back. Um, I'm kind of sorry I took it out of my club, but that is a very messy bar, if you can see there. And that was why. And it does remind me a little bit of sweet plum pastry, but I did love it. Toasted acorn and oak. I didn't get a chance to try that and wanted to. So I had that. I think that's the only one in my club. I'm looking forward to that and seeing if I can find, you know, can use more this year. Um, orchard apple and spice. I think this is another great cherry uh, scent. And again, that cherry strudel and love you berry. Mm, those could have went in bakery. I don't think all this, is this bakery? Well, this is my fall bakery. <laughs> all of it is, isn't it? All right. Hmm. I didn't even realize. I have a, uh, most of an Aussie plum. I have six bars of that. And this was one of those um, Facebook marketplace, Berries Jubilee. That was a good one. If you ever get a chance, that was a really good one to vote that back. It was in this uh, last voting, I believe, but uh, it didn't make it. Droop. Mm -hmm. Waffle Delight. I have two and six cubes. Great. Um, that one, and you'll hear me say for other ones, I get a little bit of a waxy scent to them, which is why I didn't club that. There's my breakfast in bed. Definitely a favorite. Autumn Road Trip. Um, I think I got to smell it late last year and decided to stock up on a few. Um, I don't think I've melted it, but I'm looking forward to that one. Firmstead Pumpkin, um, one that I really like. Um, I don't know. I only have one. I, I love that one. Um, pumpkin Marshmallow, I like. I couldn't smell it. Um, this is one that came in my kit, Scarlet Sunflower. I used one of those last year. That was in a whiff box, and I did enjoy that. Um, Spiced Orange Harvest. I don't think that's a full bar, uh, but looking forward to using that, you know, now that it's fall. Honey Pear Cider. One bar. I trusted that would come back my first year. Scary Good. Uh, two bars of Scary Good. That autumn road trip, Whew. also messy. Uh, maple apple bourbon, um, stocked up on one last year because I really do like that scent, but I only got one. Um, Jack's Obsession, um, mostly a full bar, I think. Nope, four, half a bark, four cubes. 
casting spells. Um, didn't get a chance to try it, but I thought I loved it on cold. So I have a bar of that. Uh, vanilla bourbon. This is from the first time it came out, so that's a little bit older. I used a bar, liked it, um, but just that was it for me. Apple butter frosting. Everybody loves this. It's definitely cured, so I I'm going to use it up this year. <laughs> um, oh, you guys, I didn't like it as much as everyone else. Baked apple pie. Also couldn't smell it. I wonder if those two together, I bet, would be good. Scary uh, good. Two bars. That is a strong one. Um, I like it more. I mixed it a lot with salted toffee. The brick. We'll get to that in a minute. Salted. Mm. Why can't I remember? Uh, this is like a Christmas mostly. Um, this is Fall Bakery. I have 12 of these walnut raisin muffins. Yep. Um, very merry cranberry goes in my um, club every year. Uh, like a quarterly club, though. Okay. Pomegranate per prosecco and black raspberry vanilla came in my um, starter kit there. Uh, tinselberry, I stocked up on three of those. Really like that one. Candid, candied cranberry pecan. I knew that wasn't coming back. Um, I just got rid of it recently. But I have three. <laughs> I like it. I felt like last, like I loved it the first year. Last year I couldn't smell it. Gingerbread hugs. Um, Wassail Wonderland. Crimson berry Christmas. I love this one. Mm. A marshmallow mint. Love. In my quarterly club now. Around the campfire has to be in a club. Dancing sugar plums also goes in a club, like a, a quarterly because it's not used that often. Bakery. Please don't fall over. Blackberry meringue. Got 12 of those in that flash sale. Cotton candy cookie, uh, many of those, and that's in a couple clubs. Cookies for Santa, love, also in my bi-monthly club, even though I bought a bunch, a couple different times. <laughs> Cinnamon buttercream, love. I think I had two of those, plus a stash. Birthday wishes, uh, was not performing for me, saved them, stocked up wonderful today my birthday was yesterday and i also have a happy birthday going right now um so i have one of those and two of those today uh lemon coconut chiffon i love also in two clubs so i'm getting like 10 of that and the cotton candy cookie and what's gonna go uh right now let's see um Black, uh, wild black cherry. Very, very, very strong. Mixed with anything very strong. I have, I guess, just two sunripe and raspberry. These are actually going to be used, but they're in a, a bi monthly club as well, so I'll be getting another one. Uh, would you like a hug? I love this one. Strawberry, raspberry, and marshmallow, I believe. Um,. Rock and Ruby Raz. I think that's still my bi monthly club. It's always one of those that, you know, I think maybe can go, but really don't want it to. Sugared Strawberry, love that one, especially when mixed. Use it a lot for like strawberry pound cake. Two pink K's left. I have three It's Love. That didn't perform for me, but I wanted to get a few more. Peachy and Palm Trees, that one's gonna be in my monthly club. I love peach scents. Pink rhubarb sugar did not put in a club, hoping it comes back next year. But that's another one that needs to be tested. Um, wasn't strong. Raspberry lollipop, I love that one. I wish I wouldn't have got rid of it. <sighs> I don't know why I did. Watermelon tangerines in my cl uh, monthly club. Paradise punch, I think I have that like in a quarterly club. Um, Clementine Cupcake, that's still available. 
apricot vanilla not strong enough for me but still love it rainbow sherbet i stocked up on like four i just recently used one ruby nectarine also in the monthly club i'm trying to use a lot of these up while it's still um you know appropriate weather because it's pretty hot here this week um, rainbows and butterflies. Took that out of my club. Loved it this spring, but it was just one of those that I don't know if I felt I needed. Blueberry burst in my bi-monthly club. Blueberry rush in my bi-monthly club. Apple teeny splash. I think I put that in my quarterly club at the last minute. Bonfire bash. That's in my... Ooh, 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 ooh. I think... Well, I'm not sure. I feel like I just screamed there. That's in one of my clubs. I think it's quarterly. Banana berry. Love the scent. Can't smell it. Hoping they'll cure more for next year. Lemon sorbet. Um, I have that in quarterly. May not need it. Um, but I also have cocoa lime, which I just used up um, in that quarterly. Hina, uh, Havana Cabana. Love. Love that one. Love. Banana Rama. Another regret I just took out, but I need I needed to, you know, it was just pineapple pucker um, quarterly. So these are going to go downstairs with me. Bricks. Sugar cookie. Vanilla cinnamon maple. A whole one. That one is available in the catalog. Love the scent. Wish it were back. I had that one bar. And this brick. I'm guessing a lot of that's going to go this year. Black raspberry vanilla. Nice. Salted caramel toffee. That's what I was looking for. Uh, it is back. It will go in probably a monthly club. And I love it. I took it out, I guess, this year. Um, and really disappointed myself. I thought uh, it was one of those that was just kind of missing. But since he wouldn't reinstate that for me. Vanilla bean buttercream. Just got that one recently. Johnny Appleseed. And a whole walnut raisin muffin, which will come out. Um, I love that one with, like, probably sugar cookie or vanilla bean buttercream also. Love that for fall. Um, cut and cleanups. If you don't know what these are, uh, they work great to help absorb the wax uh, in a warmer and it'll I think it'll take like six cubes or something like that um if you want to see like a room spray collection I have quite really quite the collection um so if you are interested in that let me know is this is I have a pink strawberry mint or yeah pink sugar berry mint I have a scary good these are all new in this one these are all used, and I think we have some more new ones over here. Yeah, wonderful. And these are some scent packs. I use scent packs in my car. I'm able to hang them over because I have like this little, excuse me, sorry about that. A uh, little uh, hook that I put my phone on something like that and I'm able to hang these over the vent and I really like how they work so I'm gonna put pineapple pucker there I think I'm gonna mix that with the room spray that I have in my bathroom and I don't know what kind of pod I don't really have a pod that goes with that That's a fun one. Okay, great. Pumpkin roll. Uh, it's gonna be like a fruity fruitiness in my car. I love I love the berry bright pods. They were great. Um Ah, we'll mix that with blueberry. I don't know why. Can't tell you. But I keep all that also from Target in this nice little storage area. Sorry for the ugly carpet, but that's what we're working with now. And that is how I store my Scentsy, guys. Um, if you have any questions or 
I think you can kind of tell what my set prim scent preferences are from probably that collection video. And, uh... We should be all set, guys. Um, if you have any questions about my collection, about what's going on, um, why I do it this way, how it's working, so far I would say it's working well. Um, when they get full, um, you know, they move around a little bit, but they're not hard. You could tell I was doing that one-handed. Uh, they are not hard uh, to uh, reorganize and set and see what I have and how many and, you know, that kind of thing and reevaluate when I need to, or just, uh, you know, I'm sitting here at my desk, uh, just turn around if I need a, uh, quick scent <laughs> break, <laughs> something to up with me while I'm working at home. Uh, and then that basket again is from Target and it matches that one up there. And you can see I have the Rock Quarry Warmer down there. Um, and two of the Glimmer and Glow. And this is my makeup area of uh, the office because that's what it was originally for. And there's Bubbled Iridescent, which is just a beauty. Currently going in here is Sugarberry Mint. There's some makeup storage plus a few other things yep so that's the room oh doggy's messed up that chair but i'll give you <laughs> it's a nice room i love it um and i thought i'd just uh, give you a quick tour of it so thanks so much you guys um my website is chris c-h-r-i-s cook c-o-o-k at sensi.us.com if you have any questions, let me know. Um, and I'm, of course, happy to uh, help you with anything. Um, again, I, you know, as I said, I, I get some money back um, for what I purchase. And, uh, you know, that's kind of why I got into this right now. But I'd be happy to give you my um, assistance in anything that you need, of course. Um, this is my third fall catalog with Sensi, and if you know if you want to join or anything like that let me know I'll be able to get you some information on that um I've been watching all those training videos so there's a lot that's fresh in my mind and if you have any questions on any of the scents even if they're not in my drawers and they're current they're in that little tester bag and I can help you out with that I'd be glad to even if they're not um, something that, you know, I would normally purchase or like. I can give you um, good descriptions of them. So please let me know if you uh, need anything. I'd be glad to help you out. And um, I will do some more Scentsy videos. Um, I think lately, well, I haven't done many. <laughs> uh, but, and this is my first one as a consultant. But um, I would be happy to help you out and... Uh, you know, obviously, you know, do whatever I can to get answers and everything for you if, if you don't have a consultant already. Um, but thanks so much. Um, you guys know that Lisa uh, Roberry has wonderful videos herself. And hopefully um, I will get there <laughs> on my own as well. Um, there will definitely be some face-to-face -face, uh, videos also in the future. So thanks so much, you guys. Uh, appreciate you watching and please leave me a comment or a thumbs up you know please you know let's make this interactive so thank you so much bye bye